just want to let you guys know I'm buying multiple pay-per-views November 28th, Mike Tyson, Roy Jones Jr., December 5th, Errol Spence Jr., Danny Garcia. I'm giving away multiple pay-per-views. The way how you can win, the only thing you have to do is subscribe to the YouTube page and follow the Instagram page and you're automatically entered. Thank you. Pound for pound box channel, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, comment below, share, do all of that. It's your host, F Merritt. Hit the like button, support who supports you. Um, Canelo Alvarez, according to Eddie Reynoso, is now a free agent. He put out a press release, as you can clearly see on the screen. I'm going to read it out to you guys. And Eddie Reynoso says, in my role as a manager and coach of Saul Sa Canelo Al Alvarez, <laughs> I allow myself to communicate to the boxing community and to all our fans that starting today, November 6th, Canelo becomes a free agent. So we are ready to continue with his boxing career. All this time, we have been working very hard in the gym with a lot of responsibility and discipline to be in great physical shape and ready to fight this year, and it will be. We will announce date, rival, and place very soon, and we will return stronger than ever to keep growing and showing that Mexican boxing is the best. Um, In my personal opinion, hey, this is a great thing. It's a good thing for boxing. Because Canelo is not stuck on an app. Um, I think when they filed the lawsuit against the zone, even though everything wasn't together, I think that was strategically just they did that on purpose to let the zone know, hey, listen, we got something on you, but you know what I'm saying, we will take this to court, you will do what we say. And you know, the zone was like, you know, we're not trying to get tied up in all these, you know, in the courtroom for years and years and waste all this money. Let's just let him go if he doesn't want to go. That's how I get it. And also, who knows? Maybe Canelo is not that big of a draw on the zone because the whole boxing in America on an app is just not smart for the zone if you don't have premier fighters. I'm pretty sure. I mean, I've heard rumors of the zone sending out offers to fight Canelo, but everybody's turned it down. You know, PBC turned it down. And, and it kind of makes sense. It's like, you know what? Why would we spend money with them to keep them in business when we could just wait it out? Make sure keep all our fighters over here. Do our in-house fights. Canelo's, you know, the pressure for him to fight someone is is going to grow bigger and bigger. They're going to get tired of him fighting, you know, uh, not premier fighters over there on the zone. And guess what? He's out of his contract. He's a free agent doing going, doing fight by fight basis. Um, I'm pretty sure I him and him have a good relationship. You know, him and Floyd have a good relationship business wise. And we can make something happen. It, it kind of all makes sense. It kind of makes sense how Showtime last year didn't really, you know, put on good fights. They were prob they were possibly trying to save that money for Canelo. You really think about it. So now we have a good fight schedule for for uh, Showtime. We could possibly get a Canelo over on Showtime. Or possibly get Canelo on Fox. Do you? Could you imagine the numbers if Canelo comes to Fox and fights David Benavidez? Caleb Plant, who was rumored to be his next opponent. It's a rumor. Um, to Char Charlo, you know, like the, the options, there's so many options there. So, I mean, hey, it's, I like it. Canelo, you know, get off of the zone, do what you got to do. For the zone, I don't know what you're going to do. It's like you got all this money and nobody respects you. That's crazy to me. It's like your money's not good here. They don't have premier fighters. So, what does that say to all the other fighters on the zone? Billy Joe Saunders, Triple G, uh, Callum Smith, Danny Jacobs. Like, come on, man. You guys got to get it together. But Canelo, hey, sky's the limit. He can, al he can always come back to the zone. He can, you know, go anywhere he wants to go on a fight-by-fight -fight basis. I don't know the specifics of, you know, the agreement that they came up to, I mean, came up with. But all I know is he's off a of golden boy in the zone. So, I mean, they probably came up with, a, you know, him, him to pay to get released from that. You know, he's got money everywhere. But, I mean, it is what it is. I like it. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Comment below. Share. Do all of that. It's your host, F. Mayor Pound Pound Boxing Channel for all things boxing. Support who supports you. Please hit the like button. Um, Let's share the show. You know what I'm saying? Support who supports you, baby. I'm out.